Pumbas mainly live in trees. Their diet is small mammals, lizards, and birds. They're extremely graceful, and in my opinion, they're the most beautiful of all the mamba species. Green mama's venom is definitely deadly, yet they're not so aggressive and it's been known that kids will be playing underneath trees infested with green mambas, yet very few incidents occur. There was a point at one, at one time when I brought several venomous snakes to Mr. Haas uh, when he was out in Punta Gorda because they were confiscated and, and, and I wound up with the snakes and I really didn't want spitting cobras and mambas so I brought them to Mr. Haas. He likes to just inspect every snake and take whatever venom he can before he sets it up and puts it into his cage. Upon opening the snake bag, all I remember is this, it was a green mamba and it just leaped right out of the bag. And he jumped back and the snake actually caught his pocket, I guess the, something on the fabric from his shirt on his pocket. All I remember in the sun was seeing that snake bite and the, the, the golden venom just go streaming right through the air in the sunlight. Mr. Host, who's handled more snakes than probably anybody in the world, he was even a little startled. So. They, they do have this agility and cunning that, that's unlike any other snake. Green mambas are, as their namesake says, they're, they're green from the tip of their nose to the tip of their tail. And, and I mean really bright green, and they are the most beautiful of all the mamba species by far. <laughs>